Oh, hello, Swastik, and welcome to our channel. And this is going to be our first session of interview. So, Swastik, our channel is very early. It's been around for eight, seven months, and its JRF has been completed. So, now we will go without wasting time. So, Swastik, first, I would like to uh, introduce you, and you can introduce yourself. Tell us your bachelor's, master's, and schooling. Now, Swastik, to you. Yes, sir. So, uh, hello, good evening, sir. So, uh, I, uh, like I'm basically based in Delhi and I did my uh, bachelor's in bachelor's and master's both in, uh, well, both from the uh, University of Delhi. I did my bachelor's in zoology honors and my uh, master's was in environment studies. I, uh, like, uh, I did my master, like I enrolled for master's in 2019. And I finished just now in uh, this um, 2021. I just finished in 2021. Yes, sir. So uh, how did you start think thinking that you should be preparing for this environmental science because you have did in uh, zoology or a different subject from environment? Yes, sir. So basically uh, um, for masters, I wanted a course like uh, which would be light basically because I knew if I wanted to do uh, uh, if I wanted to do PhD in India then I would have to um, uh, get some fellowship for me yeah, because yeah, I, uh, without without fellowship it would be uh, a very difficult thing mm -hmm. so like uh, that, that's why I wanted a very light subject to go through so that's why I chose environment studies for, for this thing and then like after choosing environment studies I just went through with this subject and then I applied for um, JRF, uh, UCN at JRF. Yes, sir. Uh, so, uh, uh, what was the number of this attempt uh, in which you cleared this JRF? Sir, this was my third attempt, basically. Oh, yeah. I uh, Yes, sir. I gave my first attempt in 2019 when I was in semester one of master's. Yeah. I uh, was not uh, much prepared, but like I wanted to uh, see like where do I stand. So mm -hmm. I gave that exam and uh, I missed uh, like the uh, net position by some point, some uh, marks. So like it gave me a huge boost because it uh, made me think that I uh, even I can also uh, qualify the net exam. So after that, I started preparing well for the exam. So I don't LSB in this No, second attempt, my LS clear. LS LS and JRF JRF नहीं हुआ था. First में कुछ भी नहीं था. Second में LS clear हो गया था. अभी third में JRF हुआ है सर. Okay. तो सबसे पहले मैं एक बहुत ही unique चीज आप मैं चाहता हूँ आप खुद ही बताएं. I would like to do you yourself. तो बच्चों को आप ये बताएं that which paid course did you entitled to take this JRF? No sir, sir. Like uh, I didn't pay anything for this thing. Uh, even I didn't buy much books. I uh, I bought just three books. Basically, one uh, uh, what you call catalyst uh, uh, question bank, and then I bought one uh, using a, a true man's book, and then I bought the Scavius Matan book. I just bought three these three books, and rest I downloaded from like uh, Telegram and YouTube channels. So I uh, I got PDFs very easily. So uh, that um, so I didn't have to buy many books for this thing. Yeah, that that yes, is sir. going to be very working for those students who are deprived or from the poor economic basis. Yes, so uh, the first question from here is the important thing start here. That what was your strategy for paper one differently and paper two differently? What was your timetable? Uh, so like uh, for paper one, uh, I um, like uh, in the beginning I just paid attention on KVS Madan book because. I had uh, I had heard that this is the Bible of paper one. So I started with KBS Madan. So I uh, went through the chapters very thoroughly. And after finishing KBS Madan, I uh, started to look for uh, like other information, like where can I uh, uh, like enrich my knowledge? I where can I increase my knowledge? So at that time, I uh, I found some uh, um, um, other channels as well. There is a channel on uh, Telegram, like N NTUGC Net Paper One, and then uh, then there is your channel also uh, mm -hmm. on Paper One. So I followed uh, just these two channels for Paper One. Uh, you had also uh, provided some uh, notes for uh, like um, uh, Indian logic as well, and then some. Um, uh, what you call uh, research, uh, uh, research aptitude for these things. So I followed all these things, and then uh, after uh, after finishing with these things, I then uh, uh, 
uh, I then practice uh, uh, like previous questions because I think previous questions are very important for yeah, paper yeah. one. Uh, and also, so I practiced uh, numericals from like uh, uh, like I bought this Arihant book. Uh, like uh, a second hand Aryan book. I had uh, it beforehand. I had the second hand Aryan book for numericals. So I practiced basic numericals on ratio proportion, uh, discount, and profit loss, all these things. Uh, all these things. So just that's it, sir, for paper one. I, this, uh, I did this, these things. So did you made a timetable, a fixed timing for paper one differently? Paper two, Zubay Padna, Rat Me Padna, Aisa Kuch. नहीं सर ऐसा नहीं था लाइक मैं ऐसा करता सर जैसे पेपर टू का जैसे एक बारी कुछ मैं अपने लिए कुछ फिक्स करता था जैसे मान लीजिए जैसे पेपर टू का जैसे गिलबर्ट मास्टर्स बुक है सो जैसे एक एक बारी मैंने पूरा बुक रिवाइज कर लिया तो एक बारी मैं पेपर वन एक बारी रिवाइज कर लेता था ऐसा करता था मतलब साइड बाय साइड करता ऐसा नहीं कि सुबह कुछ कर लिया शाम को ऐसे फिर ऐसे नहीं किया था बस एक बार कुछ कम्प्लीट कर लिया फिर उसके बाद दूसरा शुरू किया है और आपने कोई मॉक टेस्ट नहीं लिया आप क्वेश्चंस जो फ्री टेलीग्राम पे थे उन्हीं से आप सॉल्व करते थे सर हाँ सर जो जैसे डेली क्वेजेस भी आते थे जैसे जैकलिट सर का भी टेलीग्राम पे ग्रुप है और आपका भी ग्रुप है उसमें सर जैसे फ्री क्वेजेस भी आते थे और साथ में आप लोग जैसे एक्सप्लेनेशन भी देते थे साथ में तो वो वही किया था पेड तो कुछ भी नहीं किया था मैंने मतलब क्वेश्चन के लिए भी कुछ नहीं किया था यस सर नहीं इसीलिए हम आपका इंटरव्यू ले रहे हैं एंड यू आर एन इंस्पिरेशन फॉर दो स्टूडेंट हु आर स्पेंडिंग थाउजेंड टू टेक द कोर्सेज एंड वो भी अलग चीज है इट इज डिफरेंट बट और मैं आपसे अभी एक चीज बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट पूछना चाहूंगा दैट व्हाट आर योर फ्यूचर गोल्स बिकॉज यू आर द किंग नाउ आपने सबसे बड़ी चीज को हासिल किया है अब आप फ्यूचर में क्या करना चाहते हैं सर फॉर फ्यूचर लाइक माय मेन मोटिव वाज टू गेट get into a phd for phd uh, i want to answer questions related to uh, uh, animal behavior so oh. for that i would be ap ap applying for uh, phd right now so i am waiting for the forms to open then i uh, i will try for like i i search or iisc uh, wia so i will try for them like uh, at and present I'm you have a very would... bright future or uh, and last i would be taking this last question from you If you are to be given any three tips to the students, three or five tips, what would be them for the future preparing students? So, like the first and most important thing would be like, uh, uh, like you have to be persist. Uh, you have to be persist. Uh, you have to show persistence, and you have to keep trying because uh, the journey won't be easy. And uh, like uh, there would be many times where you would where you would feel that I am uh, only failing and failing. So at that time you have to uh, show resilience, and at that time you have to uh, uh, show that no, I I can do it. And uh, also that uh, you you have to remember that uh, that JRF is just an entrance exam. Okay. So the main motive is there should be to gain knowledge, not to uh, just pass an exam. So I did this thing because. Uh, if i would have joined some uh, uh, coaching class so i think uh, in coaching classes they uh, they take up a topic and then just uh, they talk about it just briefly like in one page or two page in their packages yeah, yeah. but like i wanted to do this thing thoroughly so so that um, is uh, not just for this entrance exam it would be for a lifetime so that because uh, after jrf also i have seen many people who uh, who are not landing up in any institute because they Uh, they just prepared for the exam and they uh, so they are uh, they could uh, could not land up in any institute but so i didn't uh, want this to happen to me so my main motive was to gain knowledge so i would advise people to uh, not take this exam as um, um as a life turning moment like it's it is a life turning moment but mm -hmm. it won't uh, uh, it won't uh, uh, make up your career Okay, yeah, yeah. so uh, at the end of the day, you have to um, find your own niche. So basically, uh, take um, you you just uh, focus on gaining knowledge. Yeah, because sir. and because because after this, you have to give interviews for the PhD or interviews yes, for that. So where will the knowledge be? Come, I will say that. Me. Dusra point, you want to say something about health? सर दूसरा पॉइंट कि जैसे एंड पूरा एंड गोल पे ना फोकस करके वी कैन ब्रेक अप लाइक व्हाट आई डिड वाज आई टुक अप 
uh, small small steps so I, i set myself small small goals like main roz apna ek planner pe apna banata tha ki aaj mere ko ye chapter complete karna hai ya ye chapter aadha karna hai to jaise sir aise karke fir jaise aaj main aise karke fir main sota tha bina ye karke nahi sota tha matlab chhota chhota goals karke to fir main us hisab se apne aap ko plan karta pehle chapter kar liya fir uske questions kar liye fir uske baad jo extra questions jaise jo bhi channels vagera se enviro academy ya fir aapka jackal cycle to unme se bhi thoda thoda questions nikal liye to waise waise karke maine kiya tha sir aur sab current affairs bhi usse bhi aware rehna chahiye sir to main current affairs ke liye aapke khud ke notes hain hand written Yes, मैंने सारा हैंड रिटर्न नोट मतलब ज्यादातर नहीं है मतलब मेरी राइटिंग इतनी तो अच्छी नहीं है तो मैंने ज्यादा हैंड रिटर्न नोट नहीं बनाए थे मेरा सब मेन मैं ना पी डी एफ में मैं जैसे अंडरलाइन हाईलाइट वगैरह करता था तो वो मैं सेव कर लेता था अपने पास तो सर जैसे अगली बारी में पढ़ता था तो खाली हाईलाइटेड स्टफ पढ़ता था तो जल्दी हो जाता था तो रिटर्न नोट तो ज्यादा नहीं है मेरे पास बस मेरे पास जो जो मेरे पास पी डी एफ है वो एनोटेड है तो उसमें से यस सर तो उसको मैं बार बार ही खोलता था तो उससे जल्दी हो जाता था yes, तो आप क्या कहेंगे कि हमें 10-12 सोर्स रखने चाहिए और वी शुड बी रिलायबल ऑन वन टू टू सोर्सेस और उन्हीं को बार बार रिवाइज करें बार बार रिवाइज करें सर करना तो ऐसा ही चाहिए कि मतलब वन टू सोर्स रख के फिर करना चाहिए लेकिन मैंने मैंने ये स्टेप नहीं मतलब ऐसा ही हो, हो नहीं पाता क्योंकि जैसे भी मेरे को कोई टॉपिक मिल जाता तो मैं उसको और डीपली पढ़ने का मेरे को वो मन करता तो इसी चक्कर में शायद मेरा अभी तीन बारी में हुआ नहीं तो दो बारी में भी हो सकता था शायद तो इसी चक्कर में आ, मेरा थोड़ा डिले भी हो गया शायद लेकिन ऐसे मैंने ऐसे ही प्रिपेयर किया था सर मतलब एक तो मैंने बहुत सारे सोर्सेस फॉलो किए सर जैसे मैंने यूपीएससी के मटेरियल भी फॉलो किया था फॉर जोग्राफी एंड ऑल तो वो सब भी सिलेबस कम्प्लीट किया था तो उसी चक्कर में फिर सर थोड़ा टाइम लग जाता है उसमें ना ना आपका नॉलेज काम आएगा एंड यू आर अ लॉन्ग लास्टिंग कैंडिडेट आई वुड से दैट और फिर से एक बार कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन टू यू स्वास्थ्य थैंक यू सो मच फॉर गिविंग स्टूडेंट सच इंस्पिरेशन और मैं चाहूंगा कि आप कनेक्टेड रहिएगा फिर से अगर कभी आप yes, जब आपका क्योंकि पीएचडी में एडमिशन हो जाएगा हम फिर से आपका एक बार इंटरव्यू लेंगे वेरी ग्रेट सक्सेस सो थैंक यू सो मच स्वास्थिक एंड है